Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to episode 26 of Project Architect. And um, we're, we're doing pretty good. Yes, in yesterday's episode, first of all, um, the sharp-eyed amongst you may have noticed at the beginning of the episode, I looked at how much power was going in and they said it was going to take, what, 20... Um, 24,000 years or something like that and then at the end of the episode which for you was only half an hour but for me it was like four hours later um it said 24,000 and I was like yeah we've, we've we've got you know we've cut it down no we didn't not because the numbers were the same but also because I didn't hook up a um a powerpoint so there wasn't a plug hooked up to it so there wasn't going to be that power going in so I, it's like, yeah, I only noticed it when I was editing it and I thought, should I say something? No, I'll just say something in today's episode. So um, now, actually, it's still saying 24,000 years, but the transfer is, the transfer is now more um, to 600,000 OP per tick before it was closer to half a million. So it's gone up about 1,000 OP per tick. Which is okay. Right, so um so yeah, I just thought I it's only when I was editing it late last night I noticed it and it was like, uh yeah. That's why <laughs> but like I said, it was a really long episode for me to record. So there's that. Um in between episodes I went and I put an outside on this. I don't know if I like the signalium glass. I'm still thinking about it. I still haven't done the inside, but the outside, you know, I've done the glass so you can see it. Um, here, it looks like there's nothing there, but there is luminous glass. Where is my staff or something? There's my staff. Uh, where do you want to go? Just in the power station. So I did that and I put down you know, I changed the outlook to this and all of these rods have now filled up. So if we look at it, um, obviously there's nothing in there because it's going straight in the dumb. Oh no, it's offline. I had put it online. That's strange. That is very strange. I had turned it online. But um, yeah, so then if we check the draconic, the draconic disco ball, of power. I think I might start calling it that, the disco ball of power, because it is. Alright, let's go up. Alright, so if you right click on that, and then shift retract by 10%, control retract by 50%, and um, alt apply to all rods, and I want to do alt control. And then that should put them all at 50%. And that's supposed to make it better. I mean, like I said, I don't fully understand what that does. I, I honestly, I think it's gone up by, I think it was 236 and it was 237. I don't know. I don't fully understand. As long as it doesn't go boom and irradiate my base, then, you know, I'm not that bothered. <laughs> But that is pretty much it. So today, what do we want to do? Let's go out to... I should really put one up here. I should really put a travel anchor up here. Let's just have a quick look and see if that's made a difference. Oh, yes, it took off. It took off some, so now it's saying 10,000 years. And the transfer is a whole lot more. So, yeah, we're now over 1.4 million per OP per tick. What does OP mean, I wonder? Apart from, you know, the normal OP meaning. But, um, but yeah. So there's that. That's what I spent my... I was supposed to be editing the video, but I ended up fixing up this trying to do a bit of landscaping and failing miserably 
but you know I, I tried uh, yeah it looks a bit meh but anybody who knows me and stuff you know landscaping is not my thing building is not my thing you know yes all I've done is lots of pretty boxes but that is you know I I can't I, I I'm not a very good builder so there's that um today I want to um draconic tools because you know i i think we're getting close to doing a lot of the things that we can do in this pack i mean i know i had said right at the very beginning i want to learn the magic mods and actually i'm realizing i don't really want to learn the magic mods so you know there's that i've come to that realization and that's absolutely fine but the one thing I do want to do is to kill the Chaos Dragon. And I think that will probably be, you know, the big end to the series. Because I have never killed the Chaos Dragon. I mean, up to this series, I had killed the End Dragon, what, twice? I did it in my last series, which is um, Cuboid Outpost, which is a really good mod pack. Please go check it out. It's a fun mod pack and I had done it for something else mm. peace of mind is an old series that I had it was basically um you know it was aimed at beginning minecrafters beginning not beginning minecrafters beginning minecrafters to modded and it was using modded um um mod packs but in peaceful mode that you didn't have to worry about fighting mobs and that kind of thing and learning different um learning different mods and it was a really cool mod pack i didn't finish it because um it was around that time i'd taken a break from youtube and i'd stopped it was a really cool mod pack but it used to be very intensive on my poor old potato computer right so there was that but um but yeah i had to kill the dragon no, yes, I think you did kill the dragon, but now I think about it, it was peaceful. So, how did I kill the dragon? I might be misremembering that. So maybe I've only really done it once. Well, I've only done it once or twice. That's all I could tell you. I can't remember the second time. So now I'm thinking about it, I couldn't have killed the dragon because it was peaceful. Hmm. Anyway, but yeah, you get the idea. I don't really, you know, there's a lot of basic Minecraft stuff I've never really done. So, um, so yeah, so the Chaos Dragon is going to be the big thing for me. Have I shift? No, I don't need to chunk load this now that I think about it. It's just claimed. So, um, yeah, Draconic Tools. I went ahead and I made, um, the wyvern i had to redo the wyvern stuff because i realized i needed to make in order to make the draconic tools to get them up to the next level you have to make the basic level and i had taken down the wyvern crafting before you know i had done that after before yeah before i made the tools so i went and set it back up here put in a glass floor put in some lime green elevators and just made it a little bit pretty all right, it's functional. That's all I need. So let's get this done. Um, Control G. So basically, we're going for the Draconic Staff of Power. And I'm going to try and do it as real time as possible. So we need the sword, the shovel, and the pickaxe. We don't need the bow, which is fine. I made the bow, but I didn't like how it functioned. So it's just there. But we need the pickaxe, the shovel, and the sword. All right, so there's the shovel. We don't need the hoe, so we can get rid of that. Uh, pickaxe, yes. Shovel, yes. Axe. Was that part of it? Pickaxe, no. The axe is not part of it. Not the bow. We want the pick the shovel, the pickaxe, and the sword. 
So let's start simple. Let's go for the sword. Wyvern is first. We want a diamond sword uh, and all of this. Two ace, two energy crystals. That was how many? Uh, put oh, put those in there. Let's double check it. Sword, wyvern. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right. And the sword. I found that sometimes you would you would um, shift click, but it wouldn't bring across everything into your um, inventory, which is a bit weird. Uh, what? Oh, is this on stack mode? Single item. Okay, could have put it on stack mode. All right, I think you're on single item now. And one of the, uh, whatever that is, I can't remember. Some kind of core piece of draconium another piece of draconium and were the um, draconic core and now that should be okay yes it is and it should work a bit faster because we have more we have way more energy it's still taking a while to charge up because I made the bow and I thought, oh, it's going to take forever to charge. But actually it didn't. And that was, you know, that was before we had the disco ball. So I don't know. I really don't know. So while that's busy doing its thing, let's go for the next thing. Um, Wyvern pickaxe. Ooh, nice shiny sword. I like that. And now the pickaxe. So that is that goes there. And draconic core. Two draconium ingots. Next one. Are we too far? We're too far. Uh, basic energy relay. And the wyvern energy controller. And do your thing. We did tell it. Oh, yeah, it is. That goes with my armor very well. All those shades of pink and purple. I'm not a very pink person, but, you know, it's looking cool. Why is my helmet not showing? Just out of interest. Oh, there you go. That's better. Here's our pickaxe. And I got distracted by the shiny. So, of course, I didn't make anything for the shovel. What are we missing? A diamond shovel. Have we not got a diamond shovel? Right, there you go. Uh, no, that's not what we want to do. That's what we want to do. So again, same thing. Put our shovel in there and the two ingots, draconium core, wyvern energy controller and the two energy relays.
I feel like I should say something, but you know, this is just so cool to look at. But like I said, I'm trying to do it all real time at the moment today. What is, oh, the, oh, wow. I like that model. That really looks cool. Just, you have to appreciate what, you know, what modders do with their models and stuff. I mean, I take my hats off to them because I, I couldn't do anything like that. Okay. So we need one energy controller, two awakened draconium ingots, a wyvern core, making three, and three netherite. Yes? Yes. No valid recipe. Let's have a look. What are we missing? Shovel. Oh, it's two draconium. Wait a minute. Why did it give me... No, hold on. We want the draconic. Oh, it's four of them. One, two, three. It didn't give me enough. See, I told you, it doesn't, it doesn't always drop everything that you need in your inventory. Inject, oh, we need to go downstairs. Let's take you out. And I need an empty hand. Take these things out. Actually, I probably don't need an empty hand. Yeah, don't need an empty hand. See, I make these mistakes so you don't have to. Alright, one, two. Oh, these are on stack mode as well. Really? I don't think we'd need this one. Right, let's go again. We want a shovel. So we have one controller, two awakened ingots, one wyvern core, and four netherite ingots, and that should work. There you go. It's going to be the same thing. So, one energy controller, two awakened draconium, one wyvern, and four netherite. So, I just need to get three more netherite. Deep, it only brought over three. I don't know why it does that. Is that the next thing we're making? Draconic? No, we've just made Draconic. And it's the sword we have to make next. That looks so cool. That just... That just looks so cool. Why did I close it? I need to put the sword in there. Yep. And the core. The two um, ingots. And the energy controller. I remember when I first started modding 
not modding, like I mod. When I first started playing modded, you know, all of this stuff just seemed so complicated and overwhelming and quite terrifying, to be fair. I mean, it's kind of like, um, you know, I remember I had played on, it was like one of the first SMP servers I'd played on, and um, there was somebody had a, a, a huge draconic disco ball over their base and they had the full armor and it was just kind of like, wow, you know, it was, it was like the weirdest thing and it would just seem so overwhelming. And now that I'm here playing it, it's like, nah, it's nothing. Piece of cake. Okay. We got the draconic staff of power, right? Let's bring this up. So we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, why did I do that? I could have just counted straight down. Anyway. Um, right, we need a draconic core. What are we missing? The chronic shuffle and the draconic pickaxe. We have those. Draconic. Yeah, we have those. Anyway. Um that's not what we want. I want this. Okay, that's not gonna, you're not gonna drop everything in. And we need a draconic core. All right, so we put this in here. We need four of these. And three of these, just double check. One, two, three, four, we need another one. No, that's not what we want, it's the core. The core, not, no, the core's not EMC-able. Right, we have another one. So, you put the nether star in here. One, two, three, four, and four wyvern cores. Yes, I had made these before, and I thought, you know, it needs so much power. Because I think it said it needed a million OP to, yeah, a million OP. And I was like, I don't have that much power. And that was with the basic setup I had before with the, um, with the, it was the starter, um, the, the, the starter power reactors and the small reactor that I had. And I thought it wasn't going to work, but it did. So, and it didn't take that long to craft it. But, you know, the numbers just look huge and you're like, oh, I can't do it. There's so much power, but it worked. Even with the, um, the doing the stuff for the power reactors I thought it was going to take forever because you needed like 20 million RF to do stuff and it, it worked so don't don't let the numbers scare you that's my that's my take on it you know it, it looks kind of like oh I can't do it I can't do it but actually it's it's not that bad All right one two three four a seven what else are we missing? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we didn't do the core. We didn't get the core. Oh, it's not getting us the core either. I wanted six of those, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Four and four. Oh no, we need another. We need another draconic fusion crafting injector. All right, we need to take you out for a second. Okay. Um. Injector. We have the basic one. Want the wyvern. Okay, let's go upstairs. Alright. 
so that goes in there. You just do a little bit of sorting out. Is this the right recipe? It might not be. It might be. Have a look. No valid recipe. Because why not? Alright, and let's have a look. Ah, uh, Wyvern. Four, four diamonds. Those are diamonds, right? Yeah, those are diamonds. We need a diamond. Still no valid recipe. What am I missing now? What am I missing now? Um, nope. Uh, injector. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is that what? what is that not what I had? Let's just take everything in. Oh! You can do that. <laughs> this whole time I've been shift... And you can just shift click straight in... Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I, I knew that. I was... I was testing you guys. That's what I was doing. I was I was testing you because obviously I knew that and that's my story and I'm sticking to it can't tell me otherwise <laughs> <sighs> I wonder how many of you were yelling at the screen it's like Shay you can shift click it in and yeah never mind Now, according to my real-time timer, I have six minutes left. So let's see if we can make a Draconic Staff of Power in six minutes. We should be able to, unless I derp up again. And then, you know, thank you. Right, so uh, we want... We want the Wyvern one. But I think that goes, no, Draconic, that goes in the Wyvern tier. So that is, no, that's this one. Okay. If I do that, Draconic, missing items. Okay, so I need to have them in my inventory. They're all in there. I don't understand how I shift click clicked stuff in. Or maybe you need everything. Oh, that's because it's not in my inventory, is it? Ah, there you go. Oh, if you've got it all in your inventory, you can shift click it in. There you go. Well, you learn something new every day. Okay, it's definitely draining. Now it's crafting. Okay. <laughs> and let's put these back on our hot bar. Although it probably doesn't matter if you can just shift click it all in. Yeah, it probably doesn't matter to be honest. Uh, 
Now don't use that, you'll go and spirit yourself out. <laughs> Alright, let's go downstairs. Let's put you over here. And let's twist you around. Okay, right. Now can we shift click you into here? I believe we can. Okay, so the charging is pretty fast. It's the crafting, I'm guessing, which takes all the time. Because I've never really thought about it, I've just clicked it and done it, but... Oh, the crafting's not taking too long either. And our power is holding up very well, so... Not that, I guess? Don't know. Ooh. We have a pointy thing. Have a pointy thing. No, shift C. And we need power modules. Light theme. Is that intentional? The HUD? Is it supposed to be? No, I don't think it's a. I don't think the D in HUD is supposed to be over the D in Draconic, but it just happens to be like that. And that looks pretty cool, actually. Okay, let's go. Let's go out of here. I'll put you back. And, um, yeah, let's see what we can do with this. At least it's still daytime. Where do we want to go? Oh, it's just about daytime. Um, let's go to the roof. I don't know why I want to be outside doing this when I have, I guess because, oh, I don't know. Right, so what kind of modules can we put into this? Um, okay, display additional information. There's the chess piece. Requires energy modules to function. Okay, so let's get some energy modules. Right, so you have energy, you've got the wyvern and the basic one. So I'm guessing the wyvern is the one that we want. If we get... Do you want one? I guess one is okay? Okay, so that's... Is that... Stored? Yes, it's storing energy. Okay. So what kind of modules can you put in this? Um, how can I find that out? You can enchant it. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. You can give it lots of enchantments. Auto smelt. So I guess anything you can put on a sword, a pickaxe, or a um, a um, a shovel, you can put on this. Okay, let's go and see what kind of enchantments we can put on it. Because we should have lot. I do have lots of enchantments. I don't know whether not enchantments. I do have lots of whatever this thing is. Um. And my time has just told me you've just spent thirty five minutes doing this, okay, you know we're almost finished don't 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 worry. Let's get some jelly babies, and I'm pretty sure I have loads. Hold on there you go. I knew I had loads. I find that when you travel between dimensions sometimes you it will say that you have no x p when you know you do right. So let's put this in our enchanting table. Oh, so you can't enchant it that... Oh, what? Modular item. 
So we need to have books. Now, what books do I have in here? Infinity? I don't think that works on this. Power, multi bow, mana regen, magic protection, mending. I don't think mending will come under this magnet. Okay, we could try that. Um, enchanted uh, bulwark. Bulwark? Bulwark? Don't know. Um, prevents the wielder from being knocked back and can disable an attacker's weapon. We could try that too. Phalanx? Phalanx? Phalanx. Yeah, phalanx. Allows the wielder to move faster while wearing a shield. Okay, that's cool, but I don't use a shield, so... Step height, no. Traveller. Protects against exploration hazards. Elytra. Ender pearls, cactus, bees, four resistance. What does that mean? Exploration hazards. I have no idea what that is. Projectile, protection, or oh, depth strider. All right, those are rubbish magic books. Let's go back across here. Because I do have magic books here. Uh, power, no power. I'm breaking, holding, no. There's flanks, curse of bones. Nope, piercing, aqua affinity. I have really rubbish magic books. Bane of villagers. Okay, and plague bringer. That sounds like fun. Uh, stasis, no. Buddy binding, no. Holden flanks and excavate. Excavate might work. Uh, crescendo of bolts and blessing. No. That was it, right? I think I might have more magic books on the system. But I don't know. Because somebody was saying that enchanted books don't get used up. Vorpal and reactive uh, infinity true shot quick draw lag occult aversion uh, protection power soul bound soul bound all right we have lots let's go and apply these and then we're going to end the episode All right, so put you up. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. Okay. Right, so we have our Draconic Staff of Power. I think we're going to have to name it at some point. Um. Oh, I had to take those out, didn't I? Right, can we put that on? Nope. All right, put you down there. Warpal and Reactive. Nope. Okay. This isn't a good start. Magnet? No. Is this not how you put stuff on stuff? Alright, um... Oh! Did it not give me back reactive? Okay, that's interesting. Doesn't like that anyway. Is that not how... Do I have to put it in the other one? No. That's not how you enchant it, then. Okay, well then, I don't know what I'm doing. Well, we know. I don't know what I'm doing. Alright, power. So how do I find out... Alright, so we need modules. I'm pretty sure all I did with the bow was just put... In I put infinity on it. So, I don't know. All right, let's see what modules we can make. All right, so we have the shield capacity. Oh, yes. The no shield installed is there's another shield. The, the, the shield control module. I need that. And in order to get that, I need... Um, you need Chaos Shard, so you need to kill the dragon. So that's why I'm getting that message. 
that just reminded me. No, but hold on. Oh, we have a sh Oh, no. I need another dragon heart. No, that was it. That was it. That was it. I need another dragon heart, so we need to go kill the dragon again. So we can do that in the next episode with our new stabby stick thing. Our pointy stick of power. But we need to get stuff on it. So what can, what can we have? We've got energy. Speed. Is that speed for the person or speed for the for the thing? Damage module. Could try that. No. Shift C. Alright, damage. That works. Okay, damage. Two attack damage. And what else can I get? Um, I'm guessing you could layer these. But I just want to see what I can do. Um, air of attack. And projection penetration. No, it won't, it's not going to do that. Auto fire. I didn't see that, did I? Yes, I did see that. Um, projectile immunity cancellate cancellation. Okay. Yeah, I should be missing a wither skeleton skull because I don't have any more of those. Uh, shield recovery. No, the food one. Auto food we've done. Step hill. Okay. I guess we can put AOE on it. And what was the other thing? We did damage. Let's do the next tier of damage. Oh, we need another one of these. And... Why is it saying I don't have any potions of strength? Oh, because it's different potions of strength. Okay, that's that's fine. Let's just take out some of those a second. How can I see? Oh, that's big. Um, air of attack. Now I think this is one of the things that. damage but I can't see oh big speed multiplier 100% okay air of attack is 3 safe mode disabled what does that mean when enabled this tool will not break anything if it detects a tall entity within its AOE range this will help you to protect so if I'm accidentally breaking half your brace with a single misclick. Okay. Let's put that on for now. Alright, so because, yeah. Don't know what that does. Or maybe I should just take off AoE. Seeing. Or we can try it out someplace else. Let's just go somewhere else and try it. And what other module? I think that was all we could really put on. I don't want to put on speed. I think that was all we could really put on. Um, okay. We have our, our power thing. Put these back. And let's go and find some stuff to kill. We do have that cave with the um with all the spawners and stuff. I don't think I broke the spawners. But we can go have a look. If I remember correctly, it was round there it is. Did I break all the spawners? I might have done. 
Not that I really need to because... Oh, maybe I did break all the spawners. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, come here. We need to just, like... Okay, that was two shots. Oh, there's a monster box here. Nice. Okay, come forward. Come back. Where is everybody? Oh, there you are. doing as much damage as I thought it might but you know I obviously it was just hitting me I obviously haven't configured it up to as as much as it could be okay do I need to charge this That's the next thing. Now that's Project E. Similar colours, but not the same thing. What did we get though? Uh, Essence of Death. Um, anything else? Iron Ore. Maul. Nothing of interest. These these boxes don't really drop anything good. They used to drop some really good loot. Now I'm supposed to be able to. Oh, okay. Oh, did that just clear everything? Oh, oh, I see. That's the area of effect thing. So it's taking everything out in a three by three. Bigfoot. What's Bigfoot do? Uh, baby monster. Oh, that is a hilarious one. Baby monster scare, scare from you, <laughs> which is <laughs> basically what happens. You get like the little baby zombies. They run, and they just go in the opposite direction. It is hilarious. I love that trinket. We need to put that on. Uh, Bigfoot. Okay, so this just seems to be. That's your three by three. And it was what? Shift C. Uh, no. Oh, the other bit. Fabled. Oh no, it's still... I don't know... Oh, are we full? My backpack's working again. It must have been just a a glitch. I don't know. Pick up as well. Um, okay, so it's just a three by three. This isn't all that brilliant. But I know you can make it better. But I don't know how we make it better. That is the only thing. Now I'm not going to engage with you because I'll just end up oh you. I'll try you. Oh, that one shotted you. That was well. Maybe we should try this, buddy. Then come. Okay, two shots. So how can we manage to one shot the ba bal balses, whatever it is? But you three shot a creeper. That's interesting. And it doesn't seem to be... Yeah, I don't know. But we're going to have to see how that goes. But, you know, I wanted the pointy stick of power, and I have my pointy stick of power. So, you know, I would say 
mission accomplished so in that case thanks very much for watching please like comment and subscribe it really helps to grow my channel and i will see you guys in the next episode bye bye oh wow what am i doing am i dancing i don't know about the jiggle thing that is that is weird can you not wave with the can't wave but anyhow thanks for watching bye bye <laughs>